JavaScript is a very case sensitive language. Most built in JavaScript functions require the exact correct casing when they are used. For example, get element by ID, as we see several times in this soundproofing modulus file, has get element by ID cased perfectly. If ID were capitalized, for example, this would not work. For naming conventions, this get element by ID casing is actually a JavaScript best practice in that anything with a name should be camel case. That is, the first word is lowercase, and then each subsequent word is capitalized. If we scroll down to line 66 and 67, you'll see that these two lines with these two IDs, square feet needed and square feet remaining, do not fit the camel casing best practice. Here's a caution, however. If you are going to change these, you will also want to make sure you change this everywhere it's being used or else you'll start to get errors. In Visual Studio, which is what I'm using here, the best way to do this is to use the replace feature. I'm going to select square feet needed and then I will click edit, find and replace and quick replace. Now, why did I select this? Because with this being selected, it appears here automatically. Now I'm just going to type the proper camel case in the replace box. Actually, it's called the replacement term box. I'll click replace all and it tells me it replaced it twice. So this is now using camel case. Whether you use camel case or some other casing method, realize this. Named objects in JavaScript cannot use spaces. You can use underscores to separate words, but the best practice is to just run the words together and use camel casing for casing purposes.